Don't forget to equip weapons. Yeah, I gotta. I was thinking about it too. I need more gold. I should have just been farming gold the entire run because we don't have any crafters. So the way this this team is going to get gear is I have to roll the shop at the end or now, depending on how strong the gear is. It's up to level five, so I should start rolling it. Yeah, we'll equip weapons and stuff. We'll probably buy this armor. This armor's good. Um, we need some level five scepters. I need at least two. Energy pots will be good. Mana pots are okay. Leather cape. I've never seen this. That's actually not bad. Accuracy, crit, opportunism. That's a lot of damage. Gain a weapon to help a lot. Yeah. Uh, that's what we need specifically. <clears throat> I'm not going poison. So I need... They don't even have to be like... You know, epic quality. They just need to be level 5 weapons. Alright. I'm saying thanks for the tier 3 at the 13, dude. I appreciate that. I appreciate that a lot. Alright, so all of our XP is not going to matter after this. Max perk points. Um, need a little bit of accuracy, but the crit is probably better. Maybe the flat damage, honestly. What am I building here? Bodybuilder? That's probably crit. Oh, we got Berserker. Yeah, I, I need crit and like defenses. This resistance isn't bad at that point. How much crit power? Never mind. We're getting crit. ISO. Alright. What's up, Lurking? Alright, Mr. Ryan, if you don't know that you're wasting resources. Alright, this is another crit build, right? Crit, uh, Scepter. Oh, this person couldn't even get to 11. Dude, look at this. Having, um, not having defensive training or avid learner, and they're literally like two levels behind. That is crazy. I gotta see if they get tanky enough for, um, Berserk. I need inertia too. I need so much. Nine crit though. More crit power, sure. Tagging unit for each negative alteration of a different type. I shouldn't have got this. This is a mistake. I think it's inertia because I need the movement. Defensive training is so good. We're seeing how good it is comparatively. Like this character is almost 13 with just defensive training. This character is halfway through nine without it. Oh no, we get one more knight. Oh yeah, okay, this is six. This isn't seven. Okay, we're not we're not screwed. Um Is it still inertia? I think it has to be inertia because I need the movement. And then with two magic weapons, I don't think I need sheer power as much. I also get crit runes. These would be good. Let's assess. So we got 235 for crit damage. Get crit runes. <clears throat> so if I start running out of mana, I can, you know, hit harder. Sheer power lets you ignore the resistance on the sword. You know what? I was, I was saying I have problems with single target damage, so maybe that's what we do. We get it now? I think we get it after. I think inertia is better for this wave. We'll get that. Um, 12. There's another scepter user, right? What does he have? He's got prop bounces and he's got magic damage. A little momentum. And stun. Need some mana. Or not mana, but damage. <laughs> What's up, comrade? Tried the game first run, got your ass handed to you by harpies. Uh, they they do that. 
Oh my god, the crit. Daily mana regen, it's a bit late for that. He has some stun chance though. And then we got two low. This guy got to 13. This is my blood mage momentum guy with a ton of health. Three move points. Don't need the accuracy. I'd like a huge block increase. That could be really good. I mean, five's all right, but I like something better. Get some tanky stats to keep him alive. Iso damage could be good. Um, I'm gonna roll this. Are we gonna roll this too? Opportunism? Let's see. What's this guy doing? Teleporting with, uh... He's a range damage character. Type train, whoa! Get some armor pen, could be good. Uh, movement's good, this guy doesn't have a lot. Got minus two from traits. Bonus crit, is everyone just going to crit build? What do you have for perks? He's got two, sheer power, BGH. Okay, so I'm starting to get my, my single target damage online. Is it fun going through these menus or tedious? I think it's really fun because I like building the characters. How's the game going with its full release? I think it's fantastic. Perk marking is nice when you take breaks. Yeah, it, it's been very helpful to just come back in and see where I left off. Um, Armor pen. I got sheer power too. Is more armor pen just overkill? Get some defenses. There's a lot of resist reduction there. So it says half of the target's resistance, not 50% resistance. So the sword having 70, this brings it down to 35. But I think this, um, yeah, this is flat reduction against it. So if this calculates first, then it's down to 35 and I could be 20% through that, which is 15. Well, technically 16. Which is good. I could use some block though for like the mirror shield and stuff. I think I still do it. Flat damage. Big crit though. <clears throat> I just type TSP instead of TLS. Yeah, he doesn't have enough crit uh, stuff in the trees for me to really favor it. Um, prop bounces. He's already got one. For what, Hammer of Faith? Got two stats left. Oh, I've got a bunch of ISO. This could be good. Let me get it. Lots of isolation damage. Hammer, Faith, and Blaze. Oh yeah, he's got two things for it. And it's isolation, right? Okay, Prisha, this is our like dedicated mage, I believe. Yeah. She got some crit power too, but Field Study, Blink, and Exploit. I got nothing for exploit weakness built up. Are you kidding? Oh, okay. I marked like 18 things that I'd want. <laughs> I think it's too late for Harvester. I do think it's field study. Then it could be glass cannon. Need accuracy. Yeah, let's let's roll our levels and see what we get. Yeah, it's armor. I mean, it, it is still good to have armor. 
Where'd she get all this armor from? Perks? Oh, she's got a uh, back protection. Okay. Seven accuracy. Is that more than. Oh, God. Is that better than 8% damage? What does she scale off of? Crits. Yeah, she, she's a crit build. That, that was painful. What's up, Caps? How you doing? Pretty much got my damage back there, though. This will be good for the tome. Blink to get around. I think we need glass cannon. She has too much crit to not pick this up, and I picked up that armor. Bonus. Any elite corpses? Elite corpses in the chat? No. These are all crap. This isn't even that good. Preparation took too long. Roll these. Okay, level four. Stag helm as well. Oh, it's cloth. <sighs> kind of want to give her this just for the XP gain and see if she'll make uh, one extra level. How good is this game? Incredibly fun. Oh, this is way. Oh my god, look at this. Huge gargantuan pickup. Gems are outrageous. Waiting for people to start getting to Elder Licked and be like, game is too hard. <clears throat> yeah, it looks like Baru saved that Lake Bird run the other day. Because he's on, uh, What you call it? He's on uh, Glenwald. We're not gonna go too ham yet, cause the more gold we save for next or for tomorrow night, we can roll the shop and get the best stuff. Then you roll two Nihilus? I don't know. I didn't check his characters. But that would suck. Level 5 sword. I mean, this is just a level 5 weapon. This is good enough, right? Right now. I'll save the rest. Um. Okay, give her some mana. The free mana regen. What is... What's her regen per day? 8? 13? God, they suck. Haven't seen Nihilus in a long time? Wonder if better hero traits get rid of it? No, I, I've had Nihilus as recent as, like, last week. Has D1 meets XCOM vibes? As far as you can see, are you wildly off? Uh, sorta. I mean, they are Eldritch monsters, but it's it's mostly base defense. Let's save that. We have to farm as much gold as possible. This is non-negotiable. I was thinking about it after I stopped streaming yesterday too. Is like I should have been hitting that every time. Get back. <clears throat> Reload everything. I mean, Ballista, is that like 30? I needed 30 to get an unlock, okay? Don't judge. And I did succeed in getting that unlock. We're gonna get these pushed up. 
I forget, you can leapfrog over Tall Ballista, right? He's taking all my stuff. Can I increase the music volume only? I mean, the music volume is max, but I can do this. Like to redeem the stream. We'll give away uh, an EU switch key here in a sec. Before we get started. I gotta build my warp gates. I gotta build my warp gates and hope the frickin' game doesn't destroy them. 10 times speed win. I feel like if I do that, I will not come back from it. I'm gonna build it next to the rocks. So we're in like defensive positions. I feel like a lot of black holes like to drop here, so I don't want to put that right there. Put it here though. We'll have one in the center like last time. What's the farthest point? We're all pretty far. Something like right here. Alright, um... Don't need the seasoned operators with this many of them. Until later. Uh, I'll probably pick this up though. Whoop. There you go. Alright. Oh, do we start? No, we we don't roll the shop yet. Let's put on some gear. Actually, is there is there a tome in the shop that I could get? Druid staff. I don't want the druid staff though. This is just for uh, this character to help get around a bit more. All right, commander armor on this one. Get rid of the tome. Probably the sword too, so she can move around. Get the warp offhand. Wait, don't they have blink already? Yeah, they do. They have something that's three a night. Oh, they have a teleport scroll. This guy can teleport with blood magic. Wait, can he? No. Oh. There you go. Um. Get some better pants. Get a tome. Get a better chest armor. Actually, I should probably give this to him. No, he can't move as far, though. What's the other weapon? Hand crossbow. A little bit of armor. Extra movement. Oh, it's the same movement. I see. He'd be down to six. Oh, yeah. Okay, we gotta keep him. Keep him moving. Okay. <clears throat> Game looks neat. It's very fun. Are all those crossbows facing the right side? That's just a static image or whatever. All right. Let's give away a key. If you live in Europe and you want to play this game on Nintendo Switch, Then type EU LOL.
but put that together. I want to see if anyone actually gets in before uh no switch and if no one's here what am I gonna do with this I just give it to do I find someone on like discord let's see if this works only works on EU accounts, I believe so. Let me see. Maybe I can't enter my own thing. No eligible users. Alright, fine. We'll do it later. I guess we'll just do it later. What's up, E5? How you doing? Here for the real strats? Don't worry, I'll, I'll be sure to disappoint. There one heal? Full, 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 full. Okay. Literally no one can use it. Not EU friendly time. I thought it was like, you know, nighttime in the EU, but whatever. How does that even work with this type of giveaway? I have a I have a key and then I hope the people entering can actually use it and then I give it to them. That's how it's always been. You're here in your EU. Do you have a switch though? That's the thing. It's not showing up. Why is it not working? It's fine, I'll figure I'll figure something out. Lack the switch, it's okay. Alright, um rolling in him from what, two sides? Well, that's generous. Okay, so from the corner in this side, I can't really see this corner, but it looks like they're so like one one here and then like the other two this way. And then this is more spread out. This is thinner. I just twitch to know if people have switched, they don't. Like I said, it's kind of up to us to be uh Honest with each other. Let's see if she can just solo this side. Um. Spread these two out. Is this another scepter? There's a range unit. Put her down here. Town is pretty small. Can't tell if production town or buildings would be good here. I don't think so. I just don't think you have the time. It's only seven nights. Like by the time you get all the production buildings made and the the loot put up to like level five, that's already like, you know, a thousand gold. Could rather roll the shop with that money. <clears throat> Let's go. Oh, looks kind of loud, hold up. Playing on turbo speed, in the interest of time. Alright, they're kind of spread out. That what we expected. 
I'll try and save all of her uh, mana as best I can too. AP. Do I have another scepter? How many scepters do I have? A lot. This character cannot move at all. He's too freaking slow. Wow, that did some damage. That's what I like to call big damage. I right, watched a video two times speed when you looked at the screen. Yeah, we gotta we gotta go hyper speed. I'm sorry. I need a movement skill in this guy besides run. What does he get run from? His armor? All his boots. Nice. Good job, Spear. The goal is to main them so the ballista kill the runners or like the things they get through. Because that feeds everyone defensive, um, defensive training XP. Blow this up. Fun fact, you can do a follow-up attack into a boomer because the explosion goes outwards. So when you take their space, you don't get hit by it. Pretty cool. You can kill the range units or the annoying stuff. Mm -hmm. Got base power stuff. Actually, no. Kill this thing. Head on inertia. Wait, no. Here. Um. Did it miss? I think it missed. Turns out zero accuracy is is kind of an issue. We we have to like target farm some accuracy next time. Stun the boomer at least. Twisted. Oh, we got the level five sword. Hold up. Inertia. 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 Oh, I'm out of movement. Ah. There you go. But she doesn't have the whatever. It's fine. But she doesn't have freaking uh, back protection. Actually, 
Gosh, that was a mistake. I, I shouldn't dash away from things. Nice. Inertia. I want to kill this stuff back here. The the ballista will shred these, hopefully. Although, stun that. Or kill them. Holy crap, dude. Isolation. Bro, I have so much damage. Oh, that's why I've got 50% ISO. Yes. Yes. Look at this four fifty. <laughs> With a level two dagger, by the way. Ugh. Got sniped by Nightbot. True. Uh, oh, what the hell am I looking at over here, dude? Inertia. He had two shots of this? Why? Or qua. <laughs> Jump. Back protection. Two shots because you don't have shocking touch. That makes sense. Music is fire for this game. It's incredible. What's up, Sean? French FM. Get your taste of world culture on my stream. I want to kill these hoppers. Actually, hold up. Move one more. Kill that guy, too. Skill range on Crush is so goofy. <laughs> uh. This character has like negative skill range, dude. And we're doing damage. Is inertia a buff after moving? Yes. What's up, BB? Inertia is um, when you move like three spaces and use a momentum skill, you get some of your movement back so you can keep running. So it's really good for momentum builds that like to run because that's the basis of how they play. Bro, I don't even need her over here. The Ballista will destroy these. Oh, 
Oh, I thought that, like, executed me. <laughs> but no, it ate one of his friends. I might, I might teleport my, uh, my mage from the bottom to the top section. Maybe not, those are getting kind of, uh, kind of, uh... Alright, halfway through. I'm a bit worried about this. Still keep moving too. Now dodge both so the zero accuracy will even hurt hurt even more. It's true. We kill the archers. Maximize our leapfrog. So we keep back protection. Goals are going to be to kill this ripper and this these boomers relatively soon. You guys in for two hundred. Wowzers. Guess I didn't need that either. I forgot that I had, um... That. They had, a uh, Windlock. That's why he's got the Scepter. So he can actually move. He's not chained down by his 8 speed. <clears throat> Again, we're going to hope that our Ballista can shoot these to death, which they should be able to. A lot of them are only single targets, though. But they're coming in a little bit staggered. Like, these two will walk in and die, hopefully. Yeah, that should be alright. We got the sheer volume. I realize just how good it feels to have Ballista like this. Because basically, like, I don't have to go chase down every small thing that runs past me. I can actually let through a lot of the big shit. And then, uh, kill the small stuff. Just let me move one space. Two, three, four. Came back, those imps demons or whatever, shredded on the dance floor, yes. Leapfrog. I didn't have to run into him. That was habit. Inertia. Okay. 
Ooh, hold up. Let's double check where this can go. See that? Oh, this is <laughs> this is not this is not nice. So we're gonna have to jump. Wee. Inertia. Blowing up the boomers. Oh, hello. Still do a hundred damage. It's time to put this to the test. This thing has 90 res. Res did over a thousand damage by charging up. So we do have damage. We need more though. We absolutely need more. It's been a forge. Wanna make a perk tier list, but haven't used all the perks enough to make it super accurate. Just put blood magic at the top. Let's see how this goes. Let's see if my faith in our defenses wasn't misplaced. Those are our traps going off. Oh, we got Berserk too. Oh my god, we want to get hit. Blood Magic and Leapfrog or S+. Plus. I agree. I can't imagine not playing with Leapfrog. The fact that it's 1.2. It's massive. This one's charged. Can't be debuffed. So I have enough damage in the tank though. Oh, there's an enemy next to me? Bruh. 86, I can kill that. Got 20 dodge though. That's right, we have field study. <laughs> Evrox just auto include and makes the game so much easier. It does. That it do. Gonna tastefully blow up our boomers here. I was like, what? Tab. There we go. <laughs> Alright, we'll see if he's even safe here. It's probably not, honestly. Teleport. And carry multiple weapons? Yes. You can carry two. I don't, I don't care too much about the runner. This one should die too. Because it's already got most of its armor ripped off. Or most of its health. Okay. 
Flood that dude for good measure. <clears throat> yeah, it's getting a little, uh, a little scary. But we only have like two more pushes. So we're... This bulky's like bigger than this bulky. It seems that way. Am I tripping? Surely I'm not. This character doesn't get defensive training, so the more stuff she can kill, the better. This doesn't change, because I don't have the... I don't have Volatile. Feels bad. My backup weapon? Oh, I have a sword. What am I doing? Inertia. This side. I, I, I don't want to look at this side. Also, this thing, I don't think my ballista can kill this by itself. Not from this much HP, so I have to go hit it. I can certainly do. Jump on this one. Just something closer. Say, please don't kill me, Ripper Chan. <laughs> Voice crack. Game mechanic reminds you of Dofus, the Deez Nuts show. Control some, several characters and have billions of enemies. Ah. I'm gonna kill this archer because I don't think, I think my ballista. I gotta kill these two. This is too much, too many strong things are getting through over there. Blink. Double tap this guy. Didn't hit that like that. There we go. You just want to get rid of all the range units. Or anything that's like actually problematic. Yeah, good turn. Traps! Bro, these traps are doing work! the game at save slots i don't know why it doesn't because i would totally just restart a save like today but i feel like i'm pressured to keep this one going is buffing now One more push after this, and then we're heading towards the finish line. Okay. I'm gonna have high meta progression save and fresh save for challenge runs. Yeah, I feel you. It's because the last spell, not the last spells. Uh, smiley face. Let's see. You know, just use quick shot. <laughs> like, not only is it like just good, it's way better than exploit weakness or whatever that that what that other one was that armor pierced before. Like, it's not even close. I 
I'm gonna kill these. I gotta start killing these boomers. Still hits kind of hard. Look at that. I can make it back. I actually do have a way to stay safe here. Is that worth? I don't think so. I think it's just better to uh, bamf over. Other skills suck so much. I know, man. Like, I, I tried to use it in the past, and it just wasn't worth. I still got movement. Okay, it's on my second slot. You know what? No. Kill. No, wait, no, I want to kill this thing. I hate these. Again, we're going to leave as much of the trash up as we can for defensive training. The more of our trash gets through to the ballista, the better. How many hours do I have on this game? Like 230? 240? The game was really hard at first, too. It didn't start clicking until like 60 hours. And even then, like, just in the last, like, two days playing this, I've, I feel like I've learned even more. I was afraid of that. I was like, that's the one place I don't want to go. And it went straight there. just to buff my, my dodge a little bit. 40? All I need is the last spell, tips, and tricks video. I mean, I'll make one. I already made one for beginner tips, which the uh, the game's publisher retwe retweeted. I was very thankful. They're like, wow, this is great. They didn't say that, but I assume they liked it if they did that. It's so funny, she doesn't have a lot of movement, but her skills just carry her further and further. Like, as long as you have a focused build, the character will do well. For the most part, yeah, everything's pretty well balanced. Kind of don't want to be here. There's that bulky and stuff. Um, 300. Do I have enough to finish that? I might. I should. Hey, where's this thing logically gonna go? Here? It stops here, I still blow it up. I think it's fine. I think we can let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Gonna use my ballista. Where am I getting the skill range? Holy shit. That's right, I want I want him to get or her to get attacked. I want like the juiciest axe boomerang of my life. Yeah, that's about it. Um, that's it. This should be the last uh, set of them coming in. Oh shit, I got armor back.
<laughs> Get off my walls. Yes! Alright, we're good. Who hit me? Oh, it's a splitter. <laughs> I was like, what? What? Oh no, I'm poison. Not like I just don't have a ton of HP healing. I can't stun it, but I wanted to see if I could chain it into a good direction here. Could jump out of here. Let's protect myself. Yeah, I kind of like that because of uh, this dude. I'm pretty tanky with a lot of my characters, but I, I don't think I can stand up to... Uh, I guess I could take one of these hits, plus some other stuff. But it's fine. Relentless. One, two, three. Should not. Isolation, isolation, isolation. Nightclub FM stream is good today. Are you implying that it's not good every day? How dare. But thank you. I'm glad you are, in fact, enjoying it. Let's kill these blockers. I think sword mechanically is like one of the funnest to play. We're gonna kill this bulky and then just camp on this side, I think. You know what? I'm gonna pop my potion. In case it comes to stun me. I think dagger will do well against Shodden. Probably. Honestly, I, I need to get like a level 5 dagger. It's like the one thing I want right now. Oh, come on, dude. I don't have Execute. Bitch! Hmm. This is concerning. Stand here and try and bait some attacks. He's got enough health to survive. Pop that anyway. Alright. Um, no boomers. So, how do I thin this out? I gotta kill the archers. The rest, it, this isn't as bad as it looks. I gotta kill the accursed and like the archer. Or archers. And then the ballista should thin this out pretty hard. I think the overload perk omen might be a sleeper pick. Which one's overload? The extra consumables? Use a bag slot. Okay. That do be sounding pretty good. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna start running her the other way. Does she have any teleport besides stunning entrance? Why not? Um. I 
You know what? Screw it. I want to make sure I kill what I'm hitting. Alright. You now do zero damage for two turns. But let me make sure... No, you should die. Those are the big threats, then I'm gonna have her jump over next turn. Still 300 enemies to get down. Traps! Bro, I love the damage traps. Holy crap, these are good. A dodger survived, wow. Zero. What's up, Berg? How you doing? Some got hit. I have a little bit of panic now. Please? Why game? How's the game? It's going very good. Even though we just missed like 18 times. Oh, I'm like one away. In that case, let's kill something now. And then we'll uh, just run. Where, where is she? Oh god, she's just over here doing nothing. I do have a uh, blink. Blink twice. Should hit this one first. Right. Now the bounce. Kill these twisted over here. I guess this guy. <laughs> I missed this guy how many times? Three? Yeah, dang, dude. Nerf shot. Let's get rid of that before I have to deal with it. Surprise this wave doesn't have many elites. Yeah, they kind of don't give you too many elites in this whole level, I feel like. Besides when Freud spawns them. Should be enough to kill, right? Your blade will kill. Let's 
he's got one HP. Hard stuck at A5 with Silent and STS. Yeah, Silent feels like she has the most trouble the higher it gets. At least for me. Have you tried poison builds? That'll carry you to like... Um... Yeah, I played her. But, uh... Like, I started, I started mashing poison builds and I got stuck at like A16. After that. I could just... God, I forgot I had this. It's fine. You should know it's time for an energy pod. Yeah. I think we're good. Looking good. I got one more turn to get rid of this after. It works when you find Bouncing Flask early and both Knight and Timekeeper cure their entire poison. I didn't like, uh, I didn't like Bouncing Flask that much. Um, I'd look for, like, Deadly Poison and Catalyst. Yeah, STS. Question is, do I hit these? Cause I think these only shoot one. I wish you could see that. Oh, it's those targets one, yeah. Are any of these targets two? Maybe it doesn't show that. It must not. It's funny cause Timekeeper also counters shit builds with card limit. Timekeeper's just a, such a shit boss. Or time eater. That, that thing is so stupid. It is like the most anti-fun boss they that is in that game. I have no problem saying that. Hard counter silent. Hard counters most things because like in card games, what what's good? Um, you know, having a bunch of energy or mana or whatever to play your stuff and then drawing cards. Like if you can cycle your deck and play a bunch of shit, you win. And time eater just counters that in the least fun way possible. It's like, it'd be one thing if it got strong and then kicked your ass after it. stops your freaking turn. It's like, okay, you're done playing. You are done playing the game right now. And it's like, wow. It's very cool. By cool, I mean stupid. Blah, 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 blah. I had a... no, no. And charge up my Berserk right there. How many stacks do I have? 36! Bro, this character is gonna carry. His strength build hit for 50 with one car and block the rest. Yeah, I mean... Ironclad does surprisingly okay. Alright, go to work, Ballista. Oh no, plus 9% damage. Bro, Berserk is so good. Best in every game. What are you talking about, bro? Strength... Magic's the best build in the Souls games. Which is why, literally, so many bosses are designed to hard counter it. With all their gap closers and their huge damage. You gotta play something underpowered like a strength build with Mega Poise so you never get stunlocked and you stunlock them instead. Here's my jumping R2. I'm very good at the game. Nice. Strength is so good, why isn't there a strength too? Facts. Um, 
Put your body on the line! Melania, dude, Melania is... Melania is like the, uh, The embodiment of where the boss design went in those games. And why I think it's actually just terrible. Like, what does she do? She just hits really hard and you have, like, tight dodge windows. And she has two phases. Because every boss in the Souls games has two phases now. You can't just have one phase. It has to have two phases. Sometimes three. Like, yeah. That's fun. To, like, you know, eight people. <sighs> this is gonna be a good stun. <clears throat> I can't TLS bosses have one phase. I know, man. Souls fans should love this game. All the bosses have multiple phases. I haven't fought her, no, but I've seen her. Watched Wooly die to her like 400 times. Watched Moon die for like two days doing his rune level one. And I'm like, wow, this boss is trash. Gotta beat the game before. Oh, before DLC? No. I, I think I've outgrown Souls games. Maybe it's the community that bugs me. Because you can't just... Maybe I just need to not listen to them, you know? Because you can't just enjoy the game anymore. This isn't a good hit. I can do this though. That's a better hit. Holy crap, she has a bunch of AP too. I'm out of movement! Can't believe you aren't using the most optimal build instead of having fun. Exactly. Um. There you go. I didn't want to blind myself there. Do that though. Oh no. We are out of movements. Good luck. Crusader slow, bad, grave robber fast, grave robber bad. I know, right? Say some stupid shit. I just I look at games like Demon Souls and the bosses were just more creative back then. You know, like Tower Knight. Um Blank oh Phalanx, you know, just like a lot of the Bulletaria bosses were cool. If you summon Z didn't beat the game exactly. I know which enemies are going to target the ritual and which are targeting your heroes. Almost all of them are going to make your their way to your base if um if they can reach it. The, like that's going to be their goal. If they can attack a hero, they usually prioritize it. Not all the time, but usually. <laughs> so, you know, when you move into the way, you can just try and drag them to you. Let's play Souls games while being attacked by angry bees and beat the game. Yeah. The Souls games are funny because it's like, they are all like the embodiment of, for one, like, you know, toxic community stuff. And two, there's always a way to just make it harder, you know? It's like, oh, 
You beat the game with magic? Try beating it with melee. Oh, you beat the game with melee? Try beating it with an unupgraded weapon. Oh, you beat it with an unupgraded weapon? Try beating the game at level one. Oh, you beat it at level one? Beat it at level one on new game plus seven. Like there's always some other thing to go through. Like Thick showed me a video. I forget who the guy's name was, but he beat, he beat souls or Elden Ring with like his fists. And you can't scale up the damage, so the boss fights would take literally hours. I don't know why, I'm just clicking at this point. You know, it's like, who finds that fun? I mean, it, it was to prove, it, what the point it proves is that, like, FromSoft just stacks way too much HP on the bosses. And it just becomes a slog. They started doing that in DS3. Like how Sister Freed has that, that middle phase that has no business existing. Like just an extra way to tack on 8k damage you have to do. Like yeah, that, that's fun. Problem is the 15 hit combos bosses do. Yeah, and then in, you know, Elden Ring and stuff like that, now they just delay all their attacks. Like they delay them more than any attack should ever be delayed. And it's like, that's just to prey upon veteran players and stuff. You don't need to do that to have fun. Oh, I know. Let's play the Souls games while you're asleep, you didn't beat them. They found HP to be an issue. The bosses had too much, you upgraded and leveled up. I mean, there's, I, I feel like they just get to a point where it's too, too much. Personally. You can't level up and upgrade too much because then you're over level. And that's not okay either. Uh... Nice, good crit. Put my body on the line. I don't really have to do too much. I can go assassinate these. No, actually, the, the heavy armor guys might be an issue. Whew. That's my rant. Thanks for listening. I'm gonna sit here and click my monsters. <laughs> Defend here. Getting in a little bit. But we're gonna like double our our turret damage very soon. How much mana? 65. Don't wanna do this. I mean that that is juicy. Stun fest, I'm achieving! Oh my god, I'm gonna achieve! Ah! Oh, I'm out of AP. <laughs> I was gonna go try and kill that bulky and ripper, but I, I got nothing left right now. I'm just gonna go whoop. I don't know nothing about the game, so you listen to more of my rant. Thank you, Berg. Rant kind of makes you think of the Pokemon community with their insane Nuzlocke. Yeah, there's there's always bad actors in communities. I mean, that, that's not to say Darkest Dungeon doesn't have it either, which is, you know, my main game. Like, I already had to call out the uh, the Redditors and the, the Torchless LOL people. 
What was the sledge for? I should be using this dude. That's right, sledge got slightly nerfed. Follow up. Follow up. Wait, what? Must have pressed the wrong thing. Okay, how far does this go? Pretty far. Alright, repent sinner! Alright, this is looking good. This side's pretty much done. I gotta kill the elite, or the big guys here, the tier twos, whatever you wanna call them. Alright, we, we recovered. I shouldn't say we recovered. We weren't, you know, in dire straits or anything, but... Sledge was buffed because Hammer Strike and Follow Up are the same range now. They weren't before. Am I tripping? I hate these blockers. This four dodge bulky! Real? Gone wild? Okay. I'm gonna charge up for like the biggest hit of my life. I can't. I actually can't. I spent so much HP. <sighs> I'm sure I got one more range before and it was super annoying. I guess it makes sense. I'm just gonna run. Hold up. Ugh. I think it's like it's done. I can't escape him. Oh, I can jump this, can I? No, I'm out of the leapy froggies. Okay, fine. Done a good job saving mana. Remember saying Pirouette being only consistent damage on a Grave Robber with Red Hook thought it was too generous to even have one by giving it a two-round CD in days, and people tried to try telling you Lunge and Pirouette spam would be OP. Ah, oh, yes. Can you bother answering? I wouldn't either, dude. Good job showing some restraint. I'm gonna have this guy assassinate that that bulky. And then jump in the wall. Oh, this guy can blow up my barrel. I don't know if I like that. Poison. Wow. New crossbow or hand crossbow is kind of good. Let's go kill those things. I think I should. He took the ballistas everywhere approach instead of having a complete wall around the base. Well, I wanted to get the ballista omen unlocked. I'm using traps too, which I never gave a fair chance. But uh, this has been pretty good. It has been pretty good so far. Jump! Get that ISO damage. 
Oh my god, dude. Huge. <laughs> Pain. My ballista! Get off of that. on the bulky and gonna kill next turn. It does have open spaces. Isn't it kind of ridiculous to have? What, uh, what are you talking about? On the perimeter? Um, some of it I just haven't... I don't have enough resources to build a full thing. But... Um, I could... I could absolutely clog this with, like, stuff. But I do kind of want to be able to run through it with my own characters. Ideally, they don't get to this part. Like, these will slow them down enough because it chokes them as they come through. But I mean, I could. I could uh, surround the base with stuff. I could surround the circle. Like, the last thing I could do is put barricades or traps here. Just so if anything gets here, it, you know, starts dying or gets blocked. Which maybe I should have. I don't know. I D K. Okay. I'm let the defensive training stuff clean up here. So the bliss will kill all these for me. Probably kill all these for me. Actually, let me get in here and take some stuff down. Oh, someone's inside. <laughs> Alright, Berg, thanks for being here. I played a little too loose here. Now I'm I lost some uh rewards. get a couple levels on pretty much everyone no item feels bad got mountains that's good nice we got two levels on supria it was the one we needed it the most god look at that xp going to work got a thousand gold exactly all right, I need accuracy. I also like some resistance. It's a lot of res. Three move points. All right. Liability. Don't really need it. Liability, biz damage. Skill range again. I need accuracy, dude. 
It's not happening. Maybe I should have took the skill range. Oh well. Alright, she gets two perks. Sheer power. Get hex too for the the double stun, the two turn stuns. Do I get berserk? I think so, because there's no cap on this, and it's a long fight. Dodge move points, armor pen. Get our defenses boosted. Two prop bounces. Iso damage. Um, there's another momentum guy, right? <clears throat> yeah. Is he a crit build? He is a crit build. Armor. Accuracy. Holy shit. Almost passed it. Opportunism. Got a lot of reliability. Mana regen doesn't matter anymore. Healing received. He has no way to heal. Just take the crit. Level four, 15, this is the highest I've ever seen. All right, he's got a, he's got 22 base accuracy. He needs a resist reduction. One AP, huge. Um, healing received. Two skill range. Um, kind of wish I had some block, but it's fine. What's this guy got going on? Momentum from gear, range damage. He's got perks. You see, wait, he gets one extra? So we have BGH. Increase the damage of all defenses by 50% within range. I really gotta try a character like this and just stick him on a watchtower with like a longbow. Could give him blink to get around the map. Wait, no, he's got a crystal, he's fine. This is better than blink. Blink has a limit. Let me see what I get for levels. If I can get him some defenses, then uh... I'll go... I'll go like Berserker. Opportunism... He can inflict status, so this is actually good. Prop damage, that'll be for Blaze. Crit power. I want block or something. Okay, that's better crit power. Iso, lots of iso damage. A little bit of armor. We'll grab Berserker. It's either that or no, we got Warp Crystal. We don't need the other thing. It's got inertia. Was I supposed to go? Um, no, I, I I made him range damage. 
Berserker's just endless, like endless scaling. All right, we're going pure mage here. A little bit of defense could be good. Change some accuracy too. Block and mana. That's a lot of mana. It's 15. A block could be good against um, mirror shield and stuff. Two perks. <clears throat> she has BGH. Getting that. Oh, mana collector. That's it. She's always going that direction. Ten percent damage. I think the uh, armor pen's better. The resist reduction. Crit power, magic damage. Oh, she has the crit tree. Okay. Extra skill range, reliability could be good. Six rerolls, multi hits. Let's see what's in the shop. Lone Wolf Helmet. Pretty good. Poison damage kind of a dead stat, but you know, res, reliability, health for my bodybuilders is really good. ISO, dodge. Really good the more I look at it. Level 4 Great Axe. For who? He needs that warp crystal. They give it to her? They take off the dagger? I don't think so. The dagger's been so good. Offhand scepter could be nice. And a magic momentum hit. She doesn't have a way to burn momentum. Interesting. Orb, Baron Cape, Speed Pot. Um, health Pot could be good. Was that five shots? Lightning Strike Scroll. For how much mana does it say? Why don't I see where? Oh. Oh, seven. There it is. It didn't show the health. New, new offhand weapons are so good. I mean, it does look tempting. Gives her magic damage, which is something she doesn't have. Which maybe I don't want that. No, because she gets berserk, so she can scale. This just gives her a big momentum hit. I'm tempted. This is my range guy, right? He's got the scepter. The bow's not that good. good. That bow's actually pretty bad at this point. I think we roll. I kinda want the power staff though. Stone potion's looking good. Hammer of Faith scroll.
kind of want to buy a scroll. But I need weapons and stuff. I think I need to uh, be good here. Mantium armor. A lot of crit. Can't remember who my crit builds are. Her? Light armor. She's been doing it all in base gear, man. Level 5 epic one. And actually a pretty good one. I don't think I built anyone for multi-hit, though. Is this a mana crystal? Heavy crystal. Pretty good, too. Like, that, that is perfect for a, uh, a scepter. Let's see. I think she's getting this chest armor. So I don't need that. But what about this? Crit momentum? This is a good helmet. Who needs a helmet? Not you. Not really you. Do I have another momentum character? I think he has some. An extra move point too. But Maybe he gets this. Does anyone have multi-hit? I mean, it's a level 5 wand. I think it's just good enough for the, the damage. Gave him multi-hit. No one else has it. I'm gonna grab it. <clears throat> okay. Spear has momentum. Need a new book. Is there a tome in here? It's not, but I, I should get one. <laughs> Multi of power stuff. Offhand sword could be very good. This is what. Um, okay, this is what. This is what uh, this character needs. Not a scepter. She needs this. Nice hat too. So I think someone already has the Inquisitor set. Yeah. He's got the code. Okay. Is Trinket slot good? Um, it is. Oh, in general, yeah. But do I need some? Yeah, kinda. I need like two or three. Does anyone hurt? Like trinket slots on multi-hit characters? <laughs> I gotta save some of my uh... I should be rolling... Maybe I leave these corpses. I think I think I'd get rid of the mountains. A lot of stuff. That's a lot of resources. Let's see how good this one does. Level four sledge, level five armor. walls around the circle now. Good. I definitely could.
That's kind of a brick. Maybe I should have did all this before I bought anything. Yeah, let's, let's put on some stuff. He was getting what? You're getting the offhand sword over here. Um, like this. Lots of crit, some crit power, good defenses. Liability. I guess the helmet for the dagger? Um, who's another one of my crit fishers? Everyone's a crit fisher, aren't they? Seven hundred life. <laughs> uh, damn, that's kind of nice, dude. Max is a hundred percent resistance. Is this like the the best defensive stat? I need a better one hand weapon. I think it, maybe I use this. Just for like the buffs and the stats. Um. This is better. Doesn't don't I have someone with like a ton of yeah right here? Let's say a ton of uh, crit damage. He does have momentum. This gives him movement. I lose a little. I lose some defenses though, and I lose isolation damage. I lose a lot of defense. No, I get blocked too. Maybe this is better. And then I can give this to someone else. I need one more helmet. Does she get the wand? I think she does. It's only one multi-hit though. Roll this, this is just crap. A good defensive shield. Oh. Oh, there it is, dude. There's my wand. I think I bought this, and this is just better, right? This uh, mana becomes resistance too. It's a little bit more defense. <sighs> right, where's that one, Dad? Surprised this doesn't lower movement. Realize the power of heavy armor skills getting 32 block for one AP is crazy. Yeah, dude. That's massive. Nice damage. I think we spend our last roll. Actually, no, don't with this helmet. Yeah, because she needs one, right? Okay, that's fine. That's, that's done. She got Frost Mage armor and helmet. 
That last armor was like a side grade at best. No Night Owls this time either. I don't think a single person had access to it. Yeah. We're gonna take that multi hit too. Boom. Alright. I think I scavenge for more supplies here. It's like, I, I don't know what items I need left. You have a switch, but you live in the States? Well, I have a switch key that I'll give out later. I have two. Um, you know, I'm gonna use the bathroom as well. We'll give out a steam key. I think it's my last one. So whoever would like a steam key. will be exclamation point steam. Twenty-two. Wait, hold up. All right, I messed up. Let me see. It says twenty-three users. 24, okay. 